What's up guys? So this morning we had an update to Fortnite Battle Royale and uh, with that update people have started data mining and they have figured out exactly what's going on with the NFL skins that are dropping in Fortnite later on this week and uh, it's pretty good news. I, I feel like you know, there, there are quite a few options here but I feel like you're going to be able to get a lot of bang for your buck kind of like the, the soccer skins in the past. So starting off we have a couple of referee skins. So one is the Striped Soldier, the other one is the Whistle Warrior and you guys you guys can see both of these are uncommon which is nice so those are going to be pretty cheap now getting into the actual player skins it pretty much works like the soccer skins did in the past. You're going to be able to buy one and change the number, change the team, stuff like that. It's just there are a few different bases that you can buy. So like it just depends on which default skin you want underneath those pads. So we've got the end zone here which is an epic. They're all epics. We've got the gridiron. We've got uh, Spike, which has Jonesy underneath there. That's probably the one I'm going to go for. And then we've got Strong Guard. And then we've also got female options, too. So we've got Blitz. We've got Interceptor. We've got Juke. And then we've got Rush. So again, you're going to be able to buy, like you could just buy one of these. Let's say you want to buy, you know, for example, you want you want Tfue here. You could buy Spike. And then from there, you're going to be able to customize it to any NFL team color that you want. Or you can have this default color here with the purple and green team Fortnite. And then you can also, I'm assuming you're going to be able to change up your number as well. So that's kind of cool. You know, you buy one epic skin and you're going to have literally like 33 or 34 skins in one, which is, uh, is pretty cool. So we've got all those. We've also got some new uh, other pieces of, of your kit. We've got the touchdown glider. Go for the extra point. You've got like the, the pig skin on there and stuff. That's pretty cool. We've got uh, the golden pig skin pickaxe which looks pretty sick. We've also got the first downer pickaxe and the upright pickaxe. All three of those all look really good to me, to be honest. I think the down sign is, is going to be the best one there. I really like that. We've also got two new emotes. We've got denied, not this time, baby, incomplete pass. You know what I mean? And uh, then we've got spike it, which is uh, you can, you know, kind of like celebrate in the end zone, throw a football down. It's going to bounce all over the place, which is uh, is kind of cool. Unfortunately, it looks like those NFL skins are going to be pretty much most of what we can expect this week. Sometimes Fortnite will add other new stuff in that isn't in the data mining that they kind of hide from people. So we'll wait and see what they do. But I would imagine those NFL skins are going to be in the shop for quite a few days. Uh, we do have this one right here, though. This is the, the final one that uh, isn't NFL related. I don't think it could be the like gridiron robot from like Fox that you guys see him like spinning the football and stuff uh, and the, the pregame shows or whatever and, and like before commercials and stuff like that. But uh, I, I don't know. He looks pretty cool. The one thing I really like is down here. If we go through all these, he's got his pickaxe, which isn't bad, but uh, he has this right here. This is a back bling that displays your eliminations. It's called E-L-I-M. It's in all caps with like dots, E dot L dot I dot M. So uh, it displays the eliminations you have for that match, which I think is is pretty awesome. I wanted to see something like this on the visitor, the, the like rocket skin that we got, like his face was all digital. And like to imagine seeing somebody running at you with a double digit number, that would be pretty intense. Obviously for a back bling, nobody's really going to see that but you. Like, I, I want it to be something that other players are going to see and get intimidated by, but uh, still, pretty cool idea. Now, on top of that, we do have a one more map change uh, this week, which was kind of unexpected. So, obviously, you guys know we had the big live event that went down that completely changed Loot Lake into what it is now. For these football skins, in celebration of that, they've actually changed the, uh, the football pitch to a football field. So uh, you guys can see this here, dude. This is really, really cool. We've got an actual full football field here in Pleasant Park. Go ahead and get rid of this chest in the middle. Dude, I'm hoping they come, uh, I'm hoping it comes with a, uh, a, a, what's it called? Like an actual football like toy that you can throw around. How sick would that be, dude? Could you imagine? Or something you could like try to kick some field goals and stuff? Dude, this is so nice. Can you break these? You can. You get uh, get metal from it. But yeah, you got uh, a full 100-yard football field with the two end zones and everything, dude. I'm I'm excited about this. It's it's kind of weird because like Fortnite is such a global game. Obviously, so many people are into Fortnite all over the world, but uh, the NFL is such such an American thing, such a, a US thing. So like 
I, I don't know. I, I, I'm i stoked for it, and I know a lot of you guys out there are stoked for it too, but I also know there are a lot of people that are just like, bro, who cares? We don't we don't care about American football. All those, all those guys do is just stay in there and to, and wait around. I, I, have you guys ever seen that infographic? It's crazy. There's like only 11 minutes of actual physical exertion or something in a game. I don't know. But uh, we got a little announcer's box up here now. Um... Nothing really too crazy changed, but I thought it was cool. So, yeah, there you guys have it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Drop a like if you did. Subscribe if you haven't already. And uh, I'm going to see you guys in our next one.